Hey guys, I am Joe Achilles. I have got a YouTube channel and an Instagram account that's Joe Achilles. Uh, I am a bit BMW obsessed. I've had quite a few over the last few years. And in fact, I currently own a M2 competition, which is fantastic. I've been down to Motec already when it was brand new to have the AC Schnitzer lowering springs fitted. I've done a few more bits and bobs to it since then, but it's now back to have the Remus sports exhaust fitted or racing exhaust, I forget what they call it, uh, but it's the twin box um, rear back box part of the exhaust. Um, and yeah, I can't wait to get it fitted for a number of reasons. The two most important reasons are number one, the M2 competition is very quiet and in fact I've had a few people call my car a Tesla recently um, and number two because the standard system if you're familiar with the car it looks quite bad it actually looks like a ball sack or a cow's udder it sits really low at the back of the car and I don't take many pictures of the back end of my car as a result so it's going to improve the aesthetics and it's going to bring back some of the sound which is really important. Mike. Magic Mike the car and he's just going to do a few revs for us. Firstly it's going to be valve closed so inefficiency. Uh, Alright go for it Mike. So just for reference, this is what it sounded like before we put the exhaust on. Okay, now with the Remus exhaust, right? Fire it up. Let's get it out of the car and uh, see how it goes. 
Right then guys, the exhaust is fitted and I, I'm really, really, really so excited about it as you probably tell from my stupid big grin on my face. It sounds, most importantly to me, when the exhausts are closed, so when we put it into say efficiency, it's actually not much louder or more dronier than the standard stock exhaust for me, which is really important on long journeys and stuff. just really smooth you can hear more exhaust sound but it's only a little bit more but when you put it into sport plus and the valves are open it just sounds mega and we've got the windows closed at the moment because the weather outside is horrific and as soon as I open it all you can probably hear is wind noise but let's just see if we can demonstrate just from in here it just sounds so good oh the bass just feathering the throttle but as soon as you Hopefully the mic picks that up. They never do properly with things like that, but I just, oh, I can't wait to take this car and go and spank it somewhere. I can't wait for the weather to get better and have the windows down. Um, but God, it sounds, it just sounds so good in here. Suddenly the M2 competition is alive again, which is just so important because it's just, <laughs> oh, there, there must've been some oil back there. Um, <laughs> But yes, I'm so pleased. Uh, thanks a lot. Thanks, Nick. Thanks, Jay. Thanks, Mike. Thanks, Remus, for producing uh, such a work of art. And obviously, thanks to Bonnie, um, who's effectively the boss at Motec. Let's not mess around. She keeps she keeps all you boys in place and uh, in line. So thank you very much, guys. I really appreciate it. Uh, the car. Oh, this is the last and probably the most important upgrade I've been waiting for, and it's finally in the car. And the car, to me, suddenly, on this drizzle dreary day the car is alive so i just can't wait to can't wait to drive it properly when the weather gets better cheers guys <laughs>